Hi, I'm Valder Beebe, and I host the Valder Beebe Show on FM radio and online television. I am famously known for That Celebrity Interview, where I conduct interviews all over the globe by cell phone, in studio, or satellite media tours. Go to ValderBeebeShow.com, YouTube.com slash ValderBeebeShow, or our partnership network with Business in the Black, BlackSuccessAcademy.com, and click on the Valder Beebe Show channel. I'll see you there. Good morning, Katie Strickland and Emmanuel. Thank you for joining me here in Dallas, Texas. Thank How are you? you. I am doing fine. I'm fine. And we're going to talk about secrets and lies. You know, this ABC's private practice. You guys are playing these parts. And if we could start with you, Katie, could you give us a, a, a basics of what we got going on? Well, for Shut Eye, I'd done Secrets of Lies in private practice in the past, but Shut Eye is uh, our new series that is premiering on December 7th, and it's premiering on Hulu. You can only see it on Hulu, and it's the new series is our first binge opportunity, so we're excited about that aspect of things. And it's a story basically following the world of psychic phenomenon here in Los Angeles, particularly... Uh, the central character who is Jeffrey Donovan playing Charlie Haverford, my husband on the show, and what happens to him after a blow to the head sort of unlocks uh, the real visions of a fake psychic. Oh, I'm so sorry I didn't say shut I Those were your previous uh, starring roles. I'm so sorry. No, I can talk about those too, but I think <laughs> shut is so much more interesting. I know, no, and I love Jeffrey Donovan. Oh, okay, he's the best. so Emmanuel, let me ask you, what's your role in shut I? I play a hypnotist that uh, originates from Vegas and comes to Los Angeles looking for a job with Katie and Jeffrey's character. Um, my character believes that uh, she can contribute a lot to the whole psychic world by infusing some hypnosis into it. And it's a really fun, kind of shady character. and. You know. New way to take advantage of people for yes. us. She <laughs> yes. has extra added benefits <laughs> through her con artist ways. <laughs> yes, and a con artist I am. <laughs> well, let me ask you ladies, why do you think magic and con artists, you know, all rolled into one, and there's a lot of uh, uh, dramas I can name with that, that seems to be resonating so at this time in life? Well, I'd never, any I'd never seen any script like this, personally. I think we talked about that a lot. It's, it's mm -hmm. really amongst the cast. We were all so intrigued in the material. And I think part of that is because, you know, in life, I think a lot of people want to have something to believe in. Mm -hmm. And people like the people we play prey upon the beliefs of others and the desire they have to know. Mm -hmm. And what you find is we are really taking a great, examination of how human behavior and manipulation and skill come into play when people really want something to tell them who they are, yeah. give them hope, give them something, uh, to hold on to. something to hold on to. And we exploit that at every turn. And I think it's really interesting to watch human behavior played out in a world where full permission is what you get. And that's mm -hmm. the world of shut eye. Mm -hmm. And you're right. We haven't probably seen a, 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 a a script like this, mm -mm. but we've seen it played out in different things. You know, if David Blaine comes on TV, you stop everything you're Absolutely. doing. He's <laughs> remarkable. <laughs> yes. He's an extraordinary talent. Yes. I know. Yeah, so we, we, we love that. But we've got women here. What What is that saying to us? I'm saying it's, it's saying power, but what do you think it's saying to us? You mean the women of this show? The women of this show. Well, I mean, you have role. this. In, well, that's one of the things I will say that really, and Isabella Rossellini, of course, the mm -hmm. great, wonderful, beautiful human that she is and talent that she is. We all talked about, you know, one of the things that Les Boheme did when he created this was he created 
as a man, some of the richest female characters I've seen written, they're all so dynamic. They're all mm -hmm. such a powerful presence, and they are not to be toyed with. Yeah. And that really is super interesting, particularly in the dynamic that I have with Jeffrey. I'm really the woman behind the man, and I'm more likely to get into a fisticuffs than he is. <laughs> He's a mental fisticuffs. Mm -hmm. I'm mental and physical fisticuffs. So it's a really, it's a wonderful opportunity, I think, to uh, really explore female power uh, of the mind, body, and spirit that mm -hmm. these women get to do, that, that they allow us to do. And then mm -hmm. she and I get to have a lot of really interesting dynamics play out as two women on this show that Absolutely. I really love seeing. And I think, Even, too, on this show, there's, you know, there's very little damsels in distress. Like, we are all pretty fearless and we'll do whatever it takes to get you know what we want <laughs> very wise we about, yeah we could talk about the power of women for a long time emmanuel will you leave us off because my time is up can you tell me when and where you want us to watch and we'll be there please tune in to hulu on wednesday december 7th and they will be releasing all 10 episodes so it's a very binge worthy show <laughs> Oh, I love my time watching great women. I huh. wish you guys the best. You're going to do a great job. Thank You're you. You're both and talented, and I've loved you in previous things, so this is my new thing with you. Thank you for being my guest Thank today. Thank you. Thank you so much.